much, uh, you mentioned them at the beginning, but I'm very proud of the distinguished party that has come with us. They remind me of translation. <laughs> Uh, uh, Ma'am, sorry, sorry, because the mic wasn't working, they gave me a new one. Uh, it's always been about security, economy, and and uh, and governance. So we look forward to our conversation, and I think we're right on time. <laughs> 我想我们时间好像差不多，我就先说到这里。非常感谢副院长，谢谢您。Mr. Vice President, um, it would be uh, Madam I th Speaker. I uh, think now the media will withdraw from uh, the room. Will be excuse themselves, <laughs> and then we will have closed door section. Thank you very much, Vice President Tsai, for your very warm words of welcome, uh, for your message from uh, President Wu, I'm sorry, that he has COVID. Please send him our best regards. We will be talking with him virtually later, uh, but thank him for initiating this meeting, and thank you uh, for your warm, warm welcome. It's an honor to join you, Mr. Vice President, as well as your distinguished members of your leadership here. Thank you so much for your presence and your kind welcome. I accept all the kind words that you said about me on behalf of the, the, the Congress of the United States, because all of that was done in a very strong bipartisan way in support of Taiwan. When you say that I'm a good friend of Taiwan, I take that as a great compliment, but I receive it on behalf of my colleagues. You acknowledged some, uh, you mentioned them at the beginning, but I'm very proud of the distinguished party that has come with us. They remind me of translation. <laughs> Uh, uh, Ma'am, sorry, sorry, because the mic wasn't working, they gave me a new one. Uh,热忱的欢迎我们非常荣幸能够和我的同事以及委员一起来到这里，也感谢您刚才的溢美之词，尤其包括对于美国国会的这个许多的赞美。即使许多对于美国对于台湾的支持都是跨党派两党的权
副院长，您刚才特别提到了这个美国通过了许多支持人权的法案，那这个其实背后有许多是今天我们在座的同事一同来协助我们来完成以及促成的，包括我们的众院外委会的主主席 Mix， 他就是在这个人权方面倡导的领袖，不论是在美国或者是在全世界，那尤其是在刚才您所提到的好几条法案当中，背后都有他的这个呃推动的力量。那另外我们的这个。呃，许多的这个人权的相关的法案也是有跨跨党派的。那我们希望未来我们的国会之间能够有更多的互相的往来以及交流。那这个是也正是呃，我们的拜登总统他这呃提出了关于这个印太的相关的战略之后，我们也大力支持的一些具体的行动。And acknowledging、uh, Chairman Mix's leadership in regard to so many of the initiatives you mentioned. I'm sure we'll have some discussion about that, and you'll hear directly from him. We come in friendship to Taiwan. We come in peace for the region. And our vice, cha our chair of the, the Veterans Affairs Committee, Mr. Takano, representing our veterans, understanding the value of peace and the avoidance of conflict. I'm sure that he will speak to us about that. But I want to salute him for his. Protection of our veterans, not just our veterans, but the veterans of all countries engaged in war. We talked about economy. And what do the、oh. translation for? Sorry, thank you. 呃，刚才我们提到我们外委会 mix 的 mix 主席，他对于这个人权的法案在背后有许多的着力以及大力的倡议。那这个呢，他所做的这一切也反映了我们对于台湾的友谊以及对于和平的支持。那另外呢，今天在座的还有我们退伍军人委员会的主席塔卡诺，他也是深刻的了解这个和平以及和平以及避免冲突的这个价值，在世界各地。因此，我要。因此，我要特别赞赏他对于在全世界对于这个退伍军人方面所做的呃各种的福利的支持，尤其不论是在美国或者是在全世界各地。Thank you.、Uh, the、uh, we talked about the economy. Thank you for bringing up the chips bill. All of these members were instrumental in passing that important legislation, which we think offers great greater opportunity for U.S. Taiwan economic cooperation. Here with us in that regard is the vice chair of the Ways and Means Committee. It was very instrumental in the passage of that, and、uh, she can share some thoughts about that. Perhaps she was with Microsoft. She is private sector oriented and visited Taiwan on many occasions, which I'm sure she'll share with us. Congresswoman Susan Del Bene, vice chair of the Ways and Means Committee. 那特别是刚才您提到的这个美国所通过的晶片法案，那这是我们今天在座的所有的这个议员都有共同的贡献的。我觉得这个晶片法案是非常好的机会，让美国以及台湾双方能够在经济的领域上共同的合作。那这个背后呃最呃重要的一个推手之一，就是我们今天在座的筹款委员会副主席 Susan De Bell。那他之前曾经在 Microsoft 还有私部门工作，我们相信在在待会儿的交流当中。中，他有很多能够与我们分享的。Where security and economy come together, our distinguished、uh, member from Illinois, Mr. Christian Murphy, is a member of the Intelligence Committee, and he saw the, the connection between chips and national security, as well as、uh, other aspects of our our cooperation, security-wise. And hear from Mr. We'll hear from Mr. Christian Murphy. Thank you, Mr. Christian Murphy.、Mm -hmm. 那当安全与这个经济要连接在一起的时候，这个就和我们来自伊利诺伊州的这个议员 Krishna Nor， 呃 ，Krishna Norsi 有相关了，因为他是和我们的情报委员会当中的成员，所以他的所负责的领域就是将这个晶片以及国安还有其他的领域共同结合。我相信等一下他也有很多意见能够与我们分享。In terms of、uh, all of the connection of this, whether it's security or Foreign affairs and the rest, and economy.、Um, uh, Mr. Uh, Congressman Andy Kim of New Jersey is a member of the Armed Services Committee, the Foreign Affairs Committee, and other committees of jurisdiction in this regard. He also has, is a former member of the State Department. He's a diplomat, and so he's 
teaching us to speak more diplomatically. <laughs> 那另外，如果是说这个所有的这个议题，呃，都要把它们连接在一起，包括不论是安全或者外交或者经济的领域的话，那我们来自 New Jersey 的这个 Andy Kim 的议员，他就能够扮演非常重要的角色，因为他不论不但是这个外委会以及军委会的这个成员，那同时他之前也曾经在国务院工作，担任外交官，所以我觉得他可以呃教我们大家怎么样。呃，在外交礼仪及外交辞令上表现的比较出色。In terms of government, as you see, our, our delegation has what we call heft. Heft.、Uh, they, they have a, a, a view of economy and security and governance. They have knowledge of the issues. They think in a strategic way about how to work together. They came here. We all did. To listen, to learn from you as to how we can go forward together. 那呃，刚今透过刚才的这个介绍，相信这个副院长可以了解，今天我们所来的这个访团是非常的有能力以及有分量的。不论是在这个经济、安全或者是战略思考等等的议题，他们都能够分享许多宝贵的意见。那今天我们来的另外一个目的，特别重要的也是要倾听。In in terms of governance, we commend Taiwan for being one of the freest societies in the world for your success in addressing the COVID interest issue, which is a health issue, a security issue, an economic issue, and a governance issue. We congratulate you for that. And as we continue to work together, we want you to know how proud we are. Of of Sandra, she told me just to address her as Sandra, <laughs> our, our director,、uh, and, and she has our confidence, and we're very proud of her leadership. 那在治理的方面，我们非常高兴知道台湾是全世界最自由的呃这个社会之一。那在许多的方面都有非常领先的成就，包括在这个防疫的这个疫情方面更是突出。那这个防疫不只是这个工位的议题，同时也是一个国安还有经济以及治理的议题。所以我们非常呃赞赏台湾在这方面有这么多出色的表现。我们也期待在未来能够在这个相关的领域继续合作。那之所以我们双方能够有这么样突出的表现，一定不能够漏掉我们 A I T 的处长孙小雅处长他所做的各种贡献。他是非常呃有能力以及非常这个卓越的一个领导者。我们非常骄傲由他代表美国政府在台湾为我们行事。And so now we look forward to our conversation about how we can work together, learning from you and and sharing some thoughts ourselves on how to protect the planet from the climate crisis. How to accelerate and learn from you? How you addressed the, the COVID crisis? How we advance uh, respect uh, for all of the people in our countries as we go forward? And again, we come in friendship. We thank you for your leadership. We want the world to recognize that. And with that, again, I thank you, Vice President Tsai, for your hospitality, for your kind words. I'll、just go back to Tiananmen Square for a moment. That was bipartisan. It was over 30 years ago. It was bipartisan when we were on Tiananmen Square, and we were there specifically making the statement on human rights. But our visit was about human rights, was about unfair trade practices, and it was about security issue of uh, 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 technology, dangerous technologies being transferred to rogue countries, to countries of concern. So our For over the years, it's always been about security, economy, and and、uh, and governance. So we look forward to our conversation, and I think we're right on time. <laughs> 呃，那呃，接下来我会非常期待我们双方呃能够互相交流，来更加的了解我们双方呃有什么样的地方能够合作，并且请听各位的意见，向各位学习，包括呃在如何在这个气候变迁的议题上共同合作，同时也学习台湾这个防疫的出呃出色的防疫成就，另外还有了解说我们要如何在全世界推动以及尊重人权。那特别感谢台湾所展现的友谊，以及呃我们希望台湾能够在全世界。
界受到肯定。那感谢副院长刚才的这个美言，还有对于我们的热忱的欢迎。那最后关于这个天安门的这个议题，我想要特别的补充：三十年前我们到天安门的这时候，那个时候我们是以跨党派的身份来前往天安门的。那当时除了我们要表达对于这个人权的支持之外，我们同时还要表达的意见是对于美呃对于中国这个不公平的贸易的做法。来表示抗议，因为这个也是一个国安的议题。当时他强迫了许多的企业进行这个呃科技技术的转移，那转移到这个所谓的流氓国家，或者是让人有所疑虑的国家来进行强迫的技术转移。所以这个国安的议题，还有经济以及治理人权都是息息相关的。那我想我们时间好像差不多，我就先说到这里。非常感谢副院长，谢谢您。Mr. Vice President,、um, it would be uh, Madam I think, Speaker. I think uh, now the media will withdraw from、uh, the room. Will be, excuse <laughs> themselves, and then we will have closed door section. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm talking. I'm talking.